Hey everyone, Jeremy Milosevic here. Please take a look down below in the description for a few links I have that can help you if you're struggling or trying to develop your endurance, your range, and have your sound just open up and blossom. Uh, that's in the description below. So I wanted to talk this week about a question I received from someone who asked me about their double buzz <clears throat> and I don't have a whole lot of experience with the double buzz I mean maybe like a long time ago it happened to me a few times but it's not something I experienced too often so I actually called up um, oh, I might hate to be a name dropper but I called up Charlie Davis who I know well enough to ask the question to and I asked him about it and he told me a few things so I want to pass that along here and then I would encourage you like since I haven't heard you and since we haven't heard you it's really difficult to say for certain what's happening but take a lesson with Charlie you know uh, go see him in person or you know zoom him or do something contact him and I'm sure he can diagnose the problem and figure it out so, but I want to just do a quick demonstration of what he mentioned to me. And it is involves a pitch bending exercise. And I think the easiest way to describe it is if you have the Schlossberg book, you go to number six and you're going to just bend the pitches. Now, some people call these lip bending exercises. You're not bending your lips. You're bending the pitch. They're not lip bending exercises. I don't know where that came from, lip bending, but it's pitch bending. So just to be really clear about that. So I'm going to just show you really quickly. I'll start on the note and I'll demonstrate what you should do and then see if this will help eliminate that double buzz little by little. So let me try this here. I'm going to set the mic down. <laughs> And then you go down in half steps. You just rest as much as you play. And try to taper the end so that it's getting softer. Okay, so short video this week. And that's all there is to it. But if you know someone or if you have a problem with the double buzz, this exercise, number six in the Schlossberg book, done that way, could possibly help you. It's impossible to know for sure but give it a try, see, see if it works, and then leave a comment below and let me know if it helped you. Okay, thanks everyone. Thanks so much for watching.